Hello everyone, Namaskar, Rajkrishna this side and today we are going to solve one more problem from partial differential equation. It's a problem from non-homogeneous partial differential equation, linear one. So how to solve problems like this? So in non-homogeneous, we have uh, one type in initially which uh, in which we resolve it into factors and we compare each factor with d minus md dash minus a but now what happens that we can't resolve this into factors okay this is not resolvable into factors then how will we find the complementary function because uh, Particular integral can uh, be found easily, but what about the complementary function? So, in this case, we have a special thing that in this type of problems, we find complementary function directly by this summation a e power hx plus ky. Now, there must be any proof of this which. Uh, I am not discussing here, but if they ask you to find complementary function in this type of problems where it is not factorable because d minus d dash square is not further factorable, so we can write if it is factorable, then you can always compare with d minus md dash minus a. So you can get uh, the further and you know how to uh, solve problems like this. Here we write like this now where this function of the relation between h and k the function of h and k is can be derived by putting d as k and d dash as uh, d as h and d dash as k in the initial equation so if we put that you get h minus k square equals to 0 or h equals to k square. So our goal is to either get h in terms of k or k in terms of h. So here we have successfully got h in terms of k. Now only thing which we have to do now is to put back this h equals to k square in this. So we get our complementary function as summation a e power in place of h put k square so k square x plus k1 this is your complementary function pi in this case is anyway going to be 0 if there would have been some RHS we would have calculated uh, no problem in that so pi is 0 so finally we can uh, write as we always do z equals to cf plus of pi so your cf here is summation a e power k square x plus ky and pi is 0 so this is your final solution for this problem again a bit different if you don't know how to because this is not factorizable then in that case how can we find cf we have a straightforward way a e power hx plus ky now uh, this uh, relation is there which you can get by putting d as h and d dash as k find h or k in term of each other h in terms of k or k in terms of h put them back and get your complementary function easily so that's it from my side. For more such problem, you can always watch my playlist on partial differential equation. That's it from my side. Thanks and have a nice day.